Hey guys, happy May 4th. <laughs> I am 35 today. I feel so blessed. I am so thankful because a lot of people, even though this year just started not too long ago, they didn't make it to see their birthday. There's a lot of people already gone and I'm here, guys. So I'm super, super thankful. All glory goes to God. Um, I feel good this morning. <laughs> and of course, guys, I didn't sleep much last night because he was still using me and giving me dreams, but he gave me so much revelation. And that to me was a birthday gift because it's it's things that I had asked him for. Um, so yeah, it's <laughs> God is funny. Um, but yeah, I... I just wanted to get on here and just give him glory for another year. I am 35 years young. <laughs> Y'all can see, I don't, yeah. Mm -hmm. There's no wrinkles, guys. I still look pretty youthful. Thank you, God. Um, but I'm thankful. If y'all hear music, my gospel music playing on my phone this morning, if y'all hear sound in the background. But um, thank you guys for all of your birthday wishes, wishes on the videos you guys left, comments. I've received emails. Um, one of my clients uh, did a painting for me and just so many, um, I'm just thankful. Thank you guys. Thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for all of the birthday wishes. I think a lot of people thought my birthday was yesterday, um, but it's today, May 4th. And guys, I used to... I'm not like a Star Wars, I don't watch that type of stuff, right? So I remember anytime someone realized May 4th was my birthday, they would say, may the 4th be with you. And I would just look at them like, what? I'm like, what are you talking about? It took someone, one of my friends who's into that stuff to be like, Nina, your birthday's on Star Wars day. I don't know nothing about no may the 4th be with you. The 4th is with me because yeah, the 4th is my birthday. So I, I didn't understand all of this stuff. I don't even know what just made me think of that. <laughs> but every time someone says like, when's your birthday? And I say May 4th, usually they say, may the 4th be with you. And I still don't understand that because I don't know nothing about Star Wars. But yeah, thank you for all of your birthday love, guys. Um, I am up early this morning. I'm about to go get a facial. I have a 90 minute massage. Um, after that, so I'm going to get a massage. I'm going to have a fancy lunch with Jesus. I am just chilling today and enjoying another day of life. Um, and I'm enjoying another day of life and I'm so grateful. Um, so yeah, I'm off today. I'm off tomorrow. No work today or tomorrow. I should have took off on Friday, but you know, two days is enough for me. But I'm so thankful. Thank you guys for being a part of what God has done with this ministry, which started from zero subscribers to something so great in a little over a year. This channel is still pretty new. Um, and he legit told me, don't tell your family, don't tell anybody that you're starting a channel. I'll bring the subscribers to you. And he did just that, guys. So I'm thankful for all 1300 and something of you guys that I don't know. I, I never marketed this channel. I never did anything but got on here and spoke the word of God and he brought you guys to me. Um, and I think that's pretty amazing for this channel to only be a little more than a year old. But when God tells you to move and you're obedient, he'll work for you. He'll bring the people. He'll bring the provision. He'll provide the food, the water, the everything. All you have to do is say, yes, Lord, use me. So I'm thankful that I was able to be a vessel even in the darkest times in my life when I started this channel. He still wanted me to get on here and minister to other people. And I say this and I'll say this and say it, say it, say it over again. Whenever we are going through something, when we decide to step up and pray for other people, minister to other people, work for God, even though we're not feeling up to it, blessings come pouring down, guys. And I've experienced it. This channel was birthed out of... Huh, depression and darkness that I was going through at the time, but God still told me to get on here and work, move for me and I'll move for you. And he did that, that book that most of you guys have purchased. And thank you guys that have purchased my book. So many sales from February to March. I haven't gotten the sales report for April, but so many book sales, which is amazing. And I couldn't have done that without you guys. So thank you for those. I had some people that brought three and four copies to give to family members. Thank you guys so much. That book was birthed at the darkest time in my life. 
that that book was birthed out of chaos and it turned into something beautiful. This channel, like when God tells you to move, all we have to do is move. He doesn't call the qualified. He qualifies the called, okay? So you don't have to be perfect. No one's perfect. You don't have to feel like you have to be at a certain level to work for him and speak for him and be a vessel. Everybody he used in the Bible was messed up. All the disciples came from off the street, okay? If he wanted some perfection, he would have got his 12 disciples from the temple, from the church. He went to the street and picked people. Everybody he used, Apostle Paul, Noah, David, everybody had some kind of chaos going on, but he used them because they answered the call. Answer the call, y'all. I'm grateful. I don't wanna make this video too long. Um, my face is itching, of course. I'm about to go get some Starbucks, y'all. I get free Starbucks today because it's my birthday. Okay, I'm about to get Starbucks, uh, my, my pistachio latte, go get a facial, go get this massage, enjoy lunch, enjoy the day. Uh, it's a bit foggy outside, that's okay. It's a sunny day to me. Um, I'm going to enjoy this day with God and just be grateful for his many blessings because he is a good God and he don't owe me nothing this morning, but... He, he, he did it anyway. He gave me a major gift. He put breath in my body. That's enough for me. And those of you that are watching this, say, this is enough for you. Like, this is enough for me, Lord. Just giving you breath because so many people did not wake up from their sleep. So many people headed to work this morning and they died in car crashes. So many people committed suicide this morning, but you, you're still here. You have your mind your, your soul is at peace. It's at ease because you are connected to God. Be grateful. Even if you feel like you're in darkness and chaos right now, and I, I didn't mean to even preach it y'all today, but even if you're going through the darkest times and you're like, God, you're saying I'm about to be abundant, like I'm walking into a harvest. This looks nothing like it. God can do, change it in an instant. Change it just like that. It doesn't take him any time. Trust him, guys. Trust him. I'll be on later. I'm doing a live at 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. Um, my sister Leticia will be my moderator. So any of y'all that want to clap and, and buck up, she going to buck up too and block y'all. So <laughs> I'm doing a live later today at 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. Any questions you want to ask me, ask away. Email them to me. You can comment under this video with questions. I'll grab them as many as I can if there's any. If you just want to come to the live and say, hey, Come say, hey, um, y'all know I don't really do lives. This will be my second live. I did a live previously on the one year anniversary of this channel, which was March 30th of this year. And this is my second live that I'm gonna do on 5-4, my birthday. And God, you guys know that this is a, a birthing month for all of us. Not all of us, because we're all in different seasons. But even if you're not in a harvest season, there's still something to be birthed within you, whether that's a new ministry, whether that's your purpose, whether that's a, whatever it is, there's still something to be birthed. So yeah, that's a now word for everybody. Everyone's just going through a different kind of birthing, okay? Because we're all in different seasons. But this is a month of birthing, guys, and crossing over. That is the prophetic title that the Lord gave me for the month of May that is for many of you guys. Um, but yeah, I'll be on 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. Central Standard Time, guys. I did um, set a, a live reminder, whatever. Um, so hit that reminder button to remind you when I'm live. It'll pop up on your feed. Um, but yeah, I'll be on later just to spend some time with y'all to say hey, answer questions. Um and yeah, we're just going to kick it and talk because um, y'all, many of y'all, I consider y'all my family, my sisters and brothers in Christ. Um, and I love y'all. So I'm going to hang out with y'all later. But for now, I'm going to enjoy my day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your birthday wishes. Again, all the love, the painting, um, the seeds. Thank you guys so much for purchasing my devotional. And um, I've received so much feedback on that devotional and how great and helpful it's been to so many people. If you haven't purchased my devotional, guys, and you've been through something chaotic and or going through something chaotic, the devotional is for so many different um, categories of people. It will bless you. And I'm not just saying it because it's my book. Ask the people who purchased it. Um, it, it will bless you. Um, it blessed me, and I, I never considered myself an author of anything, but God said to write, and I wrote, and it turned into something beautiful. 
But um, if you want to purchase my book, um, it is in the information is in my about section of my um, of my YouTube profile. You can purchase it at Barnes and Noble, um, Amazon, and iTunes. Um, it is so so good, guys. It is so so good, and it will bless bless your soul. It will bless your soul. Um, 52 days to build. Um, it's a devotional. It's a 52 day devotional and it's called she is me, but he is I am. <laughs> and the title speaks for itself. But yeah, go and purchase that. If, um, if you feel led to, it will bless you. Um, but thank you for those that have purchased it. And just thank you guys for being here. The authentic ones, not the ones that come and you want to just watch and talk back and do the most, but the authentic ones especially the ones that have been here since day one. I'm thankful for all of you, but the day one people um, that knows that God is moving within this ministry that accepts me for me because I come bold. I speak what he gives me. I'm not like every other prophetic voice. I'm just me. I don't know how to be anything else. Um, thank you guys just for being here. You being here um, is, is sowing a seed. You being here, the authentic ones, the prayers, the ones that reach out and they, they ask, to pray for me because they know that when you're pouring out to people, someone, some people have to pour into you. Okay. It takes a village. Um, so thank you. I love y'all. I will talk to y'all a little bit later. Have a blessed May 4th. Treat this like y'all birthday too. Um, but enjoy your day. Let me get out of here because I have like an hour to go get my coffee and get to where I need to get to. But I love y'all. Have a good day. Bye.